Hello everyone and welcome from Orlando, Florida. If you're new here, my name is Lexi and today I am going to Walt Disney World and I am actually running a tad bit late today because I have to do so much in the morning since I am not only like moving over to Disney property, but I also have to do the Disney Genie and get all of our rides set up this morning. So I'm super excited for the day ahead of us. However, there is a lot to do before we actually get to Disney's Boardwalk and Hollywood Studios. So without further ado, let's get right into this. Getting ready, we had to take a break to do the genie, and then hopefully the next time you see me, we'll be on our way to Hollywood Studios. All right, I just turned on the camera. My hair is half curled. We are waiting online to do the Disney Genie, and it'll be going in five, four, three, two, one. All right, this Genie is not very user friendly. Okay, so that was a lot. I probably should have prepped a little harder for that. But um, we got Mickey Minnie's Runaway Railway at 1240 to 140, and then Star Wars Rise of the Resistance from 150 to 250. So we had that, along with Ogas, and dinner at Topolino's Terrace. So should be a good day. Now I really gotta get ready because our ride will be here in like 10 minutes. Cheers. Okay, very quickly because we are on our way out. Hello vlog, meet Mikey's friend JG, who's not my... Where'd he go? Right here. <laughs> well, where'd Mikey go? <laughs> okay, well Sean's getting in the car. Our ride is here. First stop, boardwalk. Second stop, Swan and Dolphin because we are actually at two hotels between the two of us. And, well, four of us, and then Hollywood Studios. So it should be a good day. We're super excited, and we'll see you there. All right, we are here at Disney's Boardwalk, my home resort for Vacation Club. So I'm so happy to be back, but we did just give them our suitcases because our room is not quite ready yet. And we will be going down to the Boardwalk to meet up with my brother and his friend JG, and then walking over to Hollywood Studios since we can do that quite easily from here. But I'm just really, really excited to be here and eat this day going. Okay, so also the boardwalk is so pretty decorated for Christmas. I am obsessed. We are on our way to Hollywood Studios. Is that where we're going? Yes. Good. We can like literally this. see it from here. But we are a little late because I didn't know the park opened at 7.30 for resort guests and 8.30 for everyone else. I thought it was 8.30 for resort guests. So thank you, Mikey. You're safe. For the false information. So you get an extra hour of sleep. It's fine. But we are going to run in, go to Toy Story, like you saw earlier. We do have Rise of the Resistance and Runaway Railway. It's gonna be a great day. Also, trying to use a genie and all that fun stuff. So, we're excited. Yay, yay, yay. I'm so excited. I heard it's supposed to get sunny later. It's gonna be the best day. Does anyone else just absolutely love the feeling of walking into your first park on the first day of your Disney vacation? Because I just think it's actually the best. All right, we are in. It is a little bit crazy here, but we love the craziness. That's why we come to Disney World. So, Slinky Dog first. We can't get another lightning lane until 10.30, so that one's already out. We're gonna have to do it. To get on it, or it's probably gonna get worse, so. I don't even know if the boys are behind me. Oh, they are, okay. Come on, boys. Hope they can keep up with me this trip. <laughs> we are still in line for a slinky dog, and we are actually super close now. I don't think it's been that bad of a wait. The boys would say otherwise. However, I would recommend if you are getting Genie Plus and making a lightning lane selection, I would definitely highly recommend getting your lightning lane for slinky dog and waiting in line for the railroad if those are the two rides you're interested in. I mean, if you're a Star Wars, obviously over those. We yeah, have almost there now. It's super cute here, as always, and I'm excited to ride. And as the years go by, our friendship will never die. Okay, so we just finished our lunch at Woody's Lunchbox. We got these fun lemonades, like cherry lemonade. They're really yummy, alcoholic, obviously. Having a fun time. I think we're heading over to Star Wars Launch Bay, and then we will be at Ogus Cantina next. So a lot of drinks this trip, I guess. Not mad about it. 
Okay, but like this view, I just love it. All right, the boys are getting another drink and I'm not really up for a beer yet, so I'm gonna wait. But we are waiting for some friends to get off Tower of Terror and then we're heading over to Oga's finally. So just really quick, on our way to Oga's, we are walking through the market in Star Wars Galaxy's Edge and I just really think this area is so cool. So if you've never been and seen it, I just wanted to show you guys real quick. This probably goes without saying, but Oga's Cantina is literally so cool. All right, so we are in Oga's Cantina. We just ordered our first drink. So a lot of us got the fuzzy tauntaun. We got some bachi bites. A lot of fun stuff coming. But it is my brother's very first time, and he is a crazy Star Wars fan. So hold on, he wants to give me his review. Mikey, the world's waiting for your review. The world's waiting for my review. I haven't had my drink yet. But what do you think of the atmosphere? I think the atmosphere is great. My favorite part is that guy over there. Not that guy, the guy next to him. The robot. That, that one. Rex. That's the old pilot from Star Tours, and it's probably my favorite thing that I've seen this entire play. And he's DJing. Our views to come when the food and drinks get here. Hey. Mikey. Talk to you Mikey. How do you think? My tongue is numb. Um, the rest of everything going on there is happy, so this is great. I'm happy. Do you like it? I mean, I feel like there's a party on my tongue. <laughs> God, there it is. For the vlog. Okay, so, so far today we have done so much fun stuff and now we are heading over to Galaxy's Edge to do Rise of the Resistance. We've all done it except for one of my brother's friends, which is going to be so fun to see his reaction because that ride, doing it for the first time, is literally like nothing else. So, walking through Toy Story over to Galaxy's Edge now and I'm so excited to get on Rise of the Resistance again. Heading in now. Assembled. Good. Should you be in flight prep? Look, easy to go. Hurry. All roads to transport. No need for safety here. Thank you for the ride. Oh, damn it. Sorry, Chef. Look over there. Look over there. Oh. Deck is in motion. I am Lieutenant Beck. As you heard from Ray. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Yeah. Right. I haven't done this before. Right. And then there's me. <laughs> Ryan Toy Story Mania, Lois, partner score by drinks. Let's we'll you know how it goes. 215! Yeah, I like it! Yes, ma'am, yes, ma'am. Yes, ma Thank you. Thank you. We are definitely not buying the next no, round. No, we're not buying the next round. Absolutely not. Let's go. Absolutely not. Thank you to our amazing friends who will be. We love you all. We love you all. So we are heading out of Hollywood Studios. We have had a fantastic, magical day. We have done so much fun stuff. And now we are going to take the Skyliner back to the boardwalk because we have checked into our hotel, but like we haven't been into our room yet. So we are going to do that. Some of the boys just headed over to Animal Kingdom for the rest of the day. But I'm so happy I got to take you guys along our day today in Hollywood Studios and look forward to taking you guys along the rest of our trip with us. But that is it for this video and I will see you all next time. Bye guys.